So hello, good afternoon, good morning, good evening, my fellow creative designers and content creators. Welcome once again to another exciting episode on this channel. And guys, in today's episode, this is what we are going to design. Yes, we're going to design this beautiful church flyer in Photoshop. So please, if this seems to be interesting to you, kindly stick around and then let's walk through the tutorials step by step. It's, very, it's going to be quick, fast and yeah, just sharp like that. But I also, it's going to be a step by step tutorial so that even a beginner may watch this tutorials and able to practice. And I recommend this channel to any beginner at all. And then just join me and let's learn. So without wasting much time, control N to open a new document. And I'm going to use what a size of 2000 by 2000. And then resolution is 300 RGB color mode social media. And then just type the title Beth, sorry, B the flyer all right so click on okay and then accept the changes nicely like this then quickly i'm going to work with the background so i have all these resources here i'll drag this white cloth at the background and then drop it this way press enter to check it okay so we press enter to check it and then again i'm going to bring more background drag this drop it in photoshop boom and then that is it that is it that is it now quickly I'll go and check on the image and I have this image, drag it and then post it over here, Control T and then let's scale it up this way and bring it at the center this way and this is awesome, press enter. Okay, so press enter to check it and then again I have this resources again, gradient overlay BG, I'll drag it and then drop it on the image. Good, then add layer marks onto it, press B on the keyboard, we are using a soft round brush, yeah. If yours is not there, you go to the general, yes, general, and then pick a soft round brush, and then that is it. Just okay, so we are going to clean some part of this areas away. Yes, we are going to clean some part of this away, and then make sure that we have some white space over there. Good, so that is it. Click on OK. Now, everything put everything in the group control gen and then call it background plus image BG plus image awesome thank you thank you thank you thank you now we we'll go to the resources file again drag this star and drop it over here then hold alt and then scale it down and push it beneath something like this perfect now hold alt again drag it to the side and then scale it down something small like this perfect and then you hold it you push it to this something like this this is perfect and then you release it over there now with this one selected, go to filter, go to blur, Gaussian blur, and blur it something like um, 15 pixels, and this is okay. So this, you pick, go to filter, blur again, Gaussian blur, and blur it like 5. Thank you. And then the same as this. Alright, so the same as this, also go to filter, go to blur, Gaussian blur, and blur it 5 pixels, and click on OK. Okay, so I think that is done, that is done, that is done. So come and pick this one and then the first one, Control G, and then call it what? Stars. All right, so stars is set. Then we hit on T to activate the test tool. Hit here and then type the happy. Happy, thank you. Then we use a font. We use a font, yes, autograph. We use a font called autograph and then change it to something like 15 and C boom now caps off good so let's increase here to 20 and see 22 is too small so 30 and then let's see and i think 30 is awesome 30 is awesome 30 is awesome control j to duplicate it and then control t to then bring it down this way now double click inside and then type the birthday or oh, sorry b day rather it's b b day Thank you, like, no, no, no. Okay, so then we are going to use this font. We are going to use this font. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, Control T to scale the B up a bit. And then let's see. Okay. And I think we have to zoom it up. Both the two texts, select it and scale it up a bit this way. Then come and pick the B bring it down a bit and then the happy to push it up and then the happy 
we use a hex code we use a hex code that is we pick a color from this side yeah pick a color from this side exactly so if you want it go to five seven two five seven four five uh, sorry seven five two five seven four seven five two five seven four that is the hex code for it then click on ok this way then you zoom it out again and then i think this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome and then the name so sorry we put this and this in a group and then we call it birthday be the okay so now be the is set and then i think with the name we just went to the google and then we just pick the name from here yeah we just pick the name from here Control c to copy it and then we come back to this hit here t on the keyboard and then hit con control v to paste it and then that is it that is it that is it then control c to select or cut this side away perfect 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 then then just uh, drag it this way double click inside control v to paste it again then yeah and then i think this one we use this font we use this font thank you then we break it into two apart here perfect perfect then let's scale this down to something like 20 and then we close up here we open up rather we open we open up here perfect perfect i think 15 is awesome 15 is awesome so we just push it to this side and then the archbishop let's reduce the size a bit yeah let's reduce the size a bit to something like this perfect perfect and then let's use the arrow to push it up push it up and then we pick a hex code for it i think a hex code from this side or either from this side any of them is okay any of them is okay oh uh, yeah yeah any of them is okay then this we pick a hex code for this yeah 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 so this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome then we just adjust it to the side let's scale it down to the side and then this is okay this is okay this is okay control gene to put it in a group and call it what name perfect so this is name yeah this is name now go to view go to guide go to new guide layout and set your guide yes perfect now make sure that everything doesn't exceed a certain areas things does not exceed certain areas after that we went to this rectangle to go to rectangle to here pick ellipse 2 and then hold alt uh, sorry shift to draw a beautiful ellipse yes and then pick a color for this to pick a color for this perfect and then we just type the date hit t on the keyboard and type 14 and then we type is june thank you so 14th sorry th 14th june okay then we pick drag it inside here then change the color to color white yeah we change it to color white yeah we change it to color white and then press enter this way and i think we need to reduce the size a bit to something like 15 yeah and then close up the side as well and this is awesome this is awesome this is awesome then we pick the rectangle right click and then go and pick the rectangle too and then draw a beautiful rectangle beneath it this way then change the color to that of this yellow yeah perfect and then use the arrow key to push it to the center a bit Control j to duplicate it and then use the arrow to push it up yeah push it up this way all right so that is it just push it up that way and then you have something nicely like this you have something nicely like this what again what again what again what again yeah yes that is it that is it that is it that is it and guys this is how we were able to achieve now let's put it in a group yeah let's put it in a group control gen and then call it date yes date and then after that you hold alt control shift and e to merge everything in one layer right click it and then convert to smart object now go to filter then go to camera filter and let's add beauty to the whole design let's add beauty to the whole design so please subscribe to this channel 
like share comment and share please let me know how you think just any question that you think you have for me or any questions that you have for me drop it in the comment section below and then i'll attend to you quickly and then if you need to chat with me directly or you need to you need, just you need an inspiration from a whole a varieties of people we have a whatsapp platform in which we have been designing and then putting it on it and picking an inspiration as well whereby or we share graphic ideas design ideas on the platform join the platform and let's have fun so let's push this to this side or push it to this side perfect and then we push this to something like this awesome then let me go to contrast i'll just push contra contrast a bit let me go to black i'll just push black to this way and this is awesome texture i push texture to this side then clarity let me see clarity this is okay then let me see vibrance and vibrance this is awesome and if you are okay with everything see before and after and you see realize that the after look great so if you are okay click on okay and then it will be applied onto it so guys this is how we're able to achieve this beautiful birthday flyer within a few minutes and something great has been done or we have been able to design something great yeah please as i said all the resources file used for this tutorials there will be a link for you to download all the resources in my telegram account yes in my telegram account that is where the resources file will be posted so quickly join there and then download the resources file practice and then share it with me and let's discuss it more as i said again once again please subscribe to this channel like share comment just like it like this video for me that is the only thing i want you to do for me just like this video for me and then just put up any comment at all in the comments can be your favorite emoji just type it over there and send it to me and then let's discuss more i love you i'll see you in the next tutorial until then peace